If you pay attention, you can see that you no more decide the next thing you think than the next thing I say. Thoughts simply appear in consciousness, very much like my words. What, what are you going to think next? Or what am I going to say next? I could, I could suddenly start talking about the pleasures of snowshoeing. <laughs> you know, where did that come from? from? From your point of view, it came out of nowhere. But the same thing is happening in the privacy of your own mind. You've, you've all made a, an effort to be here, presumably to hear what I have to say about free will. But there's also a voice in your head that is just saying things. <laughs> Haven't you noticed? <laughs> and, and, and many of these things have nothing to do with what I'm talking about. You're struggling to, to follow my train of thought, but there's competition. <clears throat> You're, you're, you suddenly start thinking things like, I should probably stop drinking diet soda. <laughs> Thoughts just emerge in consciousness. We are not authoring them. To, that would require that we think of them before we think them. If you can't control your next thought and you don't know what it's going to be until it arises, where is your freedom of will? <laughs>